Move it down. Starting this thing in about fuck a month. Anyways, it's smoking like crazy. And yeah, I think my car, car's right over there, kitty. Whatever. It's a good project car. I'm gonna probably bring it to school and I'll uh, fix it up there. The body's fucking rusted underneath. And I need new tires, which is gonna cost me a good eight, twelve hundred, maybe eight hundred or something. They're uh, they're fifth. Uh, the, the, the tires are 11 inches wide, 10, 11 inches wide, 225, 60, R15, and uh, they're both the same size for the front and rear tires. And, you know, as you can see, it needs a lot of body work, you know. It's going to cost me a good two, three grand to actually fix it up so I could actually be street legal. And I want to take off the tents because it looks like shit. But, you know, you can't go wrong for. Uh, uh, well, how much was it? Five hundred dollars. So whatever. Here it is. This is fiber right there, and yeah, it's just a project car for now. And it's probably gonna be on the road to, in two years. I don't know. I have no idea. My concentration right now is right on my caddy right here. Right now, what I'm doing is I'm gonna take out the calipers and the and the brake rotors, and uh, I'll uh, I'll just uh, just polish it and fix it up. I see that electric trunk. But what I'm going to do is just going to sand it down because it's rusty and if I want to pass the safety, I'm just going to sand it down because you're still in good condition. The guy parked it for about a year, you know, and you know, that's all I got to do. Just sand it down, sand all the rust down. And so far this is a big 4.6 V8, 275 horsepower and it's still 28 miles per gallon. That is a insanely amazing. Okay. Kitty. I'm not gonna start it right now because I got a few parts out, but sooner or later I'm gonna just start it. Put it as a video after I put those magnet flows. So right here, leather seats heated to it's just purely amazing to have this car for. Well, I bought it cheaper than the Firebird, and I gotta put less work. So these seats are amazing. I put armor all, all over it. It's amazing and a Bose stereo system. Right in the back, so I should see there, SLS. And then, this is my Seville. I own my own, I bought it myself. Working at Timmy's, this is what you get. Alright, drive safe. And there's more videos coming up. I got a Beetle and a truck. Heh, <laughs> well, whatever. So, no reason I bought this car because there's a Divo right there. Take the parts off that and put it in this one. And, well, obviously we ripped everything off because I don't think it'll start anymore. I don't know. I, I don't think. Probably needs a new battery. <laughs> and that engine is right over here. That's the exact same engine. And, you know, that's a DeVille. And that's a Seville. We're both 32 North Stars. Except this is a 97, this is a 95. But it's a hell of a good price to get. And then I was in love with this car for about two years. And when I tried fixing it up, because I'm getting my license in a couple of weeks. When I tried to fix it up to actually be street legal for me, well, I got to support him when I see, I got, got to go, blah, well, when I got to put a lot of work into it, not just the engine, I got to get new tires and fix up the body underneath, which is going to cost me about a grand, maybe more. That's right here, it's not costing, it's costing me about three, three, four hundred dollars to fix it all completely, and I bought it for four hundred fifty, so that's a hell of a good thing. Anyways. Mm -hmm.
Ja, peace.